Hello there, kids. It is I, Strike Cat, the one and only, coming to you with episode 44 of Skyrim. Alright, when we left off, we had actually just, uh, reached the longhouse to deal with a few enchantments, now that I'm remembering. It's been so long <laughs> since I actually did this stuff. Um, a cornered rat for finding Esburn. So, we're just gonna... I don't really want to talk to Brynjolf. He gives me the heebie-jeebies. At least as this character, he gives me the heebie-jeebies. So, I'm probably just going to not do that. Just for this time. Uh, my Stray Cat playthrough, well, I might talk to him, but probably not. Then again, that's my own time, not this. Okay. Also, I figured out some new settings for my microphone, so I'm probably not blowing your ears out now. That's probably fantastic, isn't it? Uh, and the new computer is working wonderfully, so there is that as well. Uh, I have to head to Riften for that, which means I have to get home to my carriage. Carriage. Um, is there a Okay. Okay, there's that. I was not sprinting there for a bit. I was a little concerned. Now, I know it was wrong. I apparently needed to shout. Very loudly. Uh, thought that was a person for a brief second. I'm gonna turn on Night Eye for a little bit, just so I'm able to see a little better. There we go. Man, it's been so long since I played this game. I recently uh, started playing Dark Souls, uh, a playthrough that might happen, might not, but uh, good lord, <laughs> it is difficult. I was watching the uh, Super Best Friends playthrough for it, and I expected it to be hard, uh, just from how Dark Souls 2 was, which is not as hard, still fuck your butt with a cactus hard, but not that hard, you know what I mean? It's not drilling you with it. It's just trying. I don't know where I'm going with this. I'm going to shut the fuck up. And head to our house. Well, my house. Y'all people are invited, but it's technically my house. Yes, say. I could swear I saw a moth. You are, you little shit. Those are good stuff. Need those for in friggin... Oh, that's a leaf. Motherfucker. Get distracted by leaves. Like a yip yip dog. Uh. <laughs> being distracted by falling leaves. Yep. Yeah, okay, that's not. Uh, anyway. <laughs> I don't know where my train of thought was going. I went off in 19 different directions. <laughs> I'm so not used to this, I'm sorry. It's going to be a while to get me back in the swing of things. But so far, I'm happy with the computer. I'm happy with, you know, progress in general. I saw you guys really loved my vlogs, more or less. <laughs> me being the dink that I am. Where? There's my house. It's over here. Why am I over here? The fuck? And I already pretty much scavenged these for all they're worth. So we'll go to my house to talk to my carriage driver over here. Gunga! Gunja! I want you to take me to Riften for things. Well, I'm back and we'll be off. I don't need to tell you why I need to go there. You just need to take me there. If you've never been to Riften, be sure to visit the Blackfriar Meadery. Mm -hmm. Talk to Dad and your I'll forget all about the long trip, huh? I'm sure I will. I'll probably forget all about the whole day, too. Just saying. Combat-based magic only improves when used against valid opponents. Well, no shit. There we go. Rift in. Well, the stables. Look at these horses. That's so pretty. Ah, they're so pretty. Well, you found the right place. Um, 
I'm not too lazy to lock. walk, walk, but okay. Lazy to lock. Walk. Walk. Okay, that's enough of that. Hold there. Okay. Before I let you into Riften, you need to pay the visitor's tax. Well, fuck you. What's the tax for? For the privilege of entering the city. What does it matter? Uh, this is obviously a shakedown. All right, keep your voice down. Want everyone to hear you? Uh, what's going on? Is there a dragon? I have a feeling there's a dragon. What the? No, even worse. Spiders. Well, worse for them. <laughs> That's a weird little glitchy poo. Wait a minute. I forgot I had. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, Tom was dumb. Stray was very, very dumb. Oh. Well. Enjoy the blindness for a little bit. Because it's going away. There you go. Jesus Christ. I thought I had Fire Breath equipped. I forgot I was still in nighttime mode when I first did the thing. Steel arrow. There we go. Alright. Heading to Riften now. Oh, I need to grab my phone real quick. Okay. Successfully bashing with either a shield or a weapon will always stagger an opponent. Well, that goes without saying. Kinda. The School of Destruction focuses on the mastery of fire, frost, and shock, and is used to cast spells such as Fireball, Ice Spike, and Lightning Bolt. Give me a moment. Really quick. I need to do a thing. Okay. Ugh. Another run in with a what? Thief's guild. Oh, I'll put my sword away now. <laughs> the thieves' guild has Maven Blackbriar at her back. Yeah. One snap of her fingers, and you could end up in Riften Jail. Or worse. They okay. represent the reason I'm here. I can't just ignore them, Eren. I know. I just don't this want guy's to dress move. pretty fancy, though. You're the only good thing that's happened to this city in a long time. Don't know uh, what he, what position he's holding. This girl's You're obviously an adventurer. Too, huh? Oh, lioness, eh? Visitors like us are rare in this part of Skyrim. Well, that goes without saying. You're not from Riften. I've been adventuring across Tamriel since I was a fresh-faced young woman, barely able to swing a blade. Mm -hmm. My travels have taken me from High Rock to Velenwood, Elsewhere to Morrowind, and all points in between. Hey, you've been to Elsewhere. Uh, why are you here, then? Many years ago, I lost my blade, Grim Sever, within a Dremor ruin. I took it as a sign that I was wasting my days in search of wealth. Uh -huh. You and I are alike. We seek challenge and great fortune. But for me, that's where the similarities end. You see, Riften is my great beast to be slain. And my fortune comes from gratitude and trust. Really? 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 Okay, whatever you say, lady. Uh... Tell me about Riften's Thieves' Guild. To call it a guild is ridiculous. Mm -hmm. How can people who would betray one another over a gold coin be considered part of an association? Well, you're not wrong. They're the worst kind. Even the Dark Brotherhood abides by a strict set of rules and tradition. These They're thieves cool. are just rabble. What do you think? <laughs> uh, actually, I'm hoping to join them. No, that's not what we're doing here. No, 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 no. Thieves get bad juju. No, no. Uh, I agree completely. You know, I'm beginning to respect you. Awesome. Other than Eren, you seem to be the only other person I've met I might be able to trust. Uh, you're Since welcome. Since we share the same opinion of them, let me warn you that they're recruiting others to join their guild, and you should be cautious. Fair enough. I will beat them motherfucking asses. You're Ripton's protector. It's been difficult. I've Got taken the burdens that. of this city's problems upon myself, and I keep running into impossible obstacles. Mm -hmm. Corruption, lies, and deceit are the order of the day here. If it wasn't for Eren, the young man who saved my life, I think I'd already have given up long ago. How did Eren save your life? It was Eren who found me dying outside Aaron. of the Dwemer ruin. Yeah. If he hadn't brought me here and nursed me back to health, I would have died. 
Damn. When my strength returned and he told me about the problems plaguing Lifton, I decided fate brought me here for a reason. So I stayed. Fair enough. Tell me about the Blackbriar family. Maven Blackbriar, the matriarch of the family, represents everything that's wrong with this city. I bet. She's bribed countless officials, has friends back in the Imperial City, and freely associates with the Thief's Guild. Well, that's a bunch I of shit. I do everything I can to protect Riften citizens from her family, but to no avail. Maven's into some dirt. Who else is in the family? Well, there is Ingun Blackbriar, Maven's daughter. Strange mm -hmm. girl. She likes to spend time down in Elgrim's Elixirs working on her alchemy. Ah. Then you have Hemming, Maven's son. Cuckoo Spoiled bonkers. brat and heir to her empire. He follows her word like a loyal dog follows its master. And finally, ah. Sibi, the worst of all of them. He's in Riften jail for murder. Well, Save what a travels. colorful bunch. Who the hell is this kitty? Hey, you, get over here. I want to talk to you. Suck my dick. Shavari, huh? Go away, if you know what's good for you. Huh? Shavari. Um. She was the cook, wasn't she? Shavari? I could swear. I know she I was the cook. How was I to know the shipment would get robbed? She looks similarly time, dressed, but the fur is a little off. What? Are you telling me you robbed it? What? Why? 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 Are you doing this to me? Look, Shadra, last warning. Pay up or else. All I care about is the gold. Everything else is your problem. Wow. Bitch! Okay, let's... Shadra. Huh? What do you want? What kind of trouble are you in? I owe a great deal of money to someone, and I think they cheated me. I don't know what to do. Tell me the details. I was able to work out a deal with the stables in Whiterun to sell me some of their tack and harnesses. Uh-huh. I borrowed some gold from Sapphire to pay for the shipment, but it got robbed before it even arrived. Shit. Now Sapphire wants her money back, and if I don't pay her, I think she's going to kill me. That would not be good. I'll help you pay off your debt. You will? Oh, thank you. I might be able to speak some reason be careful to Sapphire. Sapphire. She mixes with all sorts of nasty people. I can tell by that armor. Good lord. So, uh... Mjol's apparently not having the best of luck getting this, but I'll see if I can help her out a little bit. I know what that marker means. I'm not gonna do that marker. No, no, no. Fuck you, you gorgeous accent having bastard. People of Riften, heed my words. Oh boy. The return of the dragons is not mere Oh, I'll just sit here and listen to this. Uh, take off my helmet so I can this look pretty. This is one of the signs. The signs that Lady Mara is displeased with your constant inebriation. No oh, boy. Put down your flagons filled with your vile liquids and embrace the teachings of the handmaiden of kind. A uh, fuck off. No, no, Mara. We talked about this. Talon? Kirava, certainly we can come to some Run sort by, of understanding. Run by Argonians. That's These people unusual. must be made aware of the chaos they've sown. Especially in Nordlands. Enough, Maramal. We've all heard of the dragons and well, their Well, that's return. a little bit of a light no need to use them as an excuse to harass our customers. Very well, Talon. I'll remove myself from this den of iniquity. Why did you come in? kicking you out. Just keep the sermons at the temple and let us all sin in peace. No shit. The church out of everything else. Fuck it. I've never seen the old this upset about anything. They're moving in too much of the shit already. Yeah. Get the church What's out. What's your problem? It's a problem with you particularly. I wanted to talk to you about Shadra's Shadra's debt. However you pronounce his I name. I knew that stupid kid would try and find a way to weasel out of his debt. Look, this is really simple. I lent him some gold. He promised to pay me back, and now he says he's broke. End of story. That does not sound exactly right. That sounds like you're trying to be a little forceful. So I know, and I know you know, this is a setup. All right, all right. I guess I made enough from his shipment. No need to waste any more time threatening a stable hand. Tell Shadra he doesn't owe me anything. Good. That's I what I thought. I hope we bump into each other again. Why? 
You one of those uh, masochistic types? Cause that's 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 weird. Uh, who the fuck are you? Look at you, fucking bald on the head, but that don't stop you from growing hair out to your shoulders. God damn. That reminds me of one of my teachers, well, substitute teachers, back in uh, high school. He used to bounce around everywhere. Cool guy. Cool guy. But, uh, you know. <laughs> he said he would grow his hair out until, uh, until Bush was out of office, and then he kept growing it out because it was cool. So, hey, you know, that's how it works. Fresh meats and produce, get them before they're gone. The fairest prices and the highest quality in Skyrim. Branche, huh? That doesn't sound... Like Never a... done an honest day's work in your life for all that coin you're carrying. Hey, lad. Uh, I've done Never a done lot of that. Never done an honest you're day's work in your life for said. all that coin you're carrying. Hey, lad. Uh, actually, I'm looking for this old guy hiding out in Riften. Ah, expecting free information, eh? Help me deal with business first. Then we'll see how I can help you. Besides, you look like your pockets are a little light on coin. Am I right? Not really. I'm actually kind of pretty good on that. Uh, let me find him first. Dragons are bad for business. Passing on a golden opportunity is worse. Okay, I'm not going to be able to talk him to anything, so you know what? Until next we meet, Lion. No, until next we don't meet. Hey, Snoof. Sure, sure, I'm a dirty beggar. Why would you want to even speak to me? That's not even what to I'm going to say. To oblivion with all of you. You rich piles of dung walking by us like we're not there. Pretending we don't exist. How dare you? Rude and not necessary. I was about to give you a gold piece, buddy, but because you seem to be so jaded and so cynical of being helped, I'll give it to you anyway. Because oh, I'm that sort of guy. Divines bless your kind heart. There you All go, right. buddy. All right. And whoop. Okay. That's. I'm pretty sure not a thing. Uh, let's go over here. Who is that? They're walking out of the palace like they're hot stuff. So this is me. Bothering. Okay. What in the name of Oblivion do you want? Your name carries weight in Riften. Of course. Nothing gets done without my approval in this city. Okay. I have the Jarl's ear and the guards in my pocket. Anyone makes trouble for me and I pay a visit to the Thieves' Guild. Make me angry and I contact the Dark Brotherhood. You do well to remember that the next time you make such a stupid observation. Rude. Out of my way. Fuck you, I'm in your way now. Hey, hey, I'm in your way. Hey, I'm in your face. I don't hey, have time I'm in your face. What I'm in your face. Okay, that's enough of that. <laughs> I would waste an entire episode doing that. That sounds way too good to be true because it is. I'll walk up this way. Whee! And the rat way, or whatever it is, is right here. There we go. And we don't need to bother talking to Brynjolf at all, really. And we'll just continue on. Huh. There are things down here, I can tell by that music. How much weight do I have? I am way overburdened. What the fuck? I thought I dealt with that. <laughs> okay, fuck that. Instead, we're gonna go right the fuck back up. <laughs> I thought I dealt with that last episode. I guess I didn't. Okay. We'll go up. I forgot I'm not in Minecraft. That button press does not work. Quality in Skyrim. Uh, where am I going? Whee! I'm all loop around. Talk if to my dad. seizes the eye, don't hesitate to make me an offer. Oh, I won't. Everything I've got on display, really. All right. Let's see what I can sell to you and maybe get off of you. Necklace of Magicka. I don't actually have a Magicka enchantment, 
I don't think. I'm pretty sure I don't. So I'll take that for now. And I'll sell you some of the other stuff I have. Um, I don't think I meant to sell that. No, I, I did. I did. Because I already had that. Alright. Uh, gold em golden emerald circuit. I like it because it's pretty. Uh, necklace of minor shore grip. I'm actually going to keep that on for the time being. And there's nothing really else I can sell to you. Oh, I can get a lockpick. That'd be nice. Um, okay, we'll call that good. Do you make your own jewelry? I do. Sadly, I'm one of the few traditional Saxlil jewelers that remains in Tamriel. Oh. It's becoming a lost art. Apparently. Only trouble is gathering materials has become hazardous. The roads to the mines and to the other cities are thick with bandits. And worse. Oh. Would you be interested in gathering some materials for me? I'd certainly be happy to compensate you. Compensation? Sure, Thank I'll get you, them Lance for you. Strider. I'm seeking a small list of items to complete my next creation. Mm -hmm. Two flawless sapphires, a mammoth tusk, uh -huh. and a chunk of gold ore. Right, let me let, let me write that down. Okay, cool. That gives me a prompt anyway. Alright. Now we'll call the episode done here for now. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And you know, share and comment so we'll be able to talk about the games we're currently playing and bring more people into this community to have you know that sort of discussion and watch these videos that i'm being a dumbass in and i will see y'all in the next episode this has been the one the only stray cat playing games for you